Hi, this is Joe Ellison, and I'm back with the fifth excerpt from the first of my Snarky and Putts Paranormal Attorneys at Law series, The Case of the Undead Arbitrator. Let's get going. There's nothing to it. The solution of this situation is so simple, I'm surprised neither one of you two figured it out for yourselves. Snarky sat behind his rosewood desk and tilted himself back in his black leather chair. On second thought, I'm not so surprised you didn't think of it, Putz. But you, Sai, you're a veteran. Sai looked to his right at Putz, then back across the desk at Snarky. If it's so simple, why don't you tell us already? Yeah, why don't you? Putz seconded. Snarky leaned forward on his elbows. He motioned to them. Come here, you two. He folded his hands together. Learn from a master. Putz and Sai leaned over the desk. Three heads huddled. Snarky began. This isn't a question of law. This isn't a question of negotiation. This is a question of getting the parties to the table. Once you get them to come to the table, the issue resolves itself and we all get paid. Putz and Sai murmured assent. How do we get them all to the table? Snarky posed. To figure out how, first we've got to ask why. Why aren't they coming? Because they're all nuts, Sai proposed. Snarky leaned back. You're not helping, Sai. You've got too much emotional capital invested here. You too, Putz. You're both too close to these women. To you, they're people. You care about them, and you let them torture you. You let them run the show. Forgive me, Sai, but it's unprofessional. I, on the other hand, have maintained the proper emotional distance. I can help them precisely because I don't give a damn about them. They're not people to me. They're clients. I don't care about them. What I care about is getting to a result and getting paid. So to me, the answer is obvious. Their father. He's the answer. He's the stumbling block. We've got to get him out of the way. Get him out of the way, Sai objected. He's dead. How much more out of the way can you be? He might be dead and cold as a mackerel, Snarky allowed, but he's alive and kicking in their heads. That's where he's real, that's where he's in the way, and that's where we've got to deal with him. And that's the end of this excerpt. I should remind you that Snarky and Putz is available for sale on Amazon, and there's a link to the uh, Snarky and Putz page. Uh, in the comments to this excerpt. Uh, thanks very much for listening in, and I look forward to seeing you again.